hi guys welcome back to my channel and so today i have a workout video to show you guys what i do in the gym things that has helped me and i've seen a lot of improvements when it comes to toning my body and also um helping my you know my little pouch that i have since i am on my weight gain journey right now and so i've been doing a lot of different workout routines and so the ones that have helped me a lot and that are very effective that anyone can do i'm sharing it right now with you guys so let's get into it now i'm gonna try and explain this the best that i can i am not an instructor i'm just trying to share my workout routine with you guys so first what we're gonna go ahead and do is lay our mat on the floor you can definitely try this workout at home now this workout is also called the bicycle crunch um so i'm putting something behind my back so that way there's a bit of a support for my back and that all of the pressure will be focused on my midsection i do three sets of 20 and crisscross my finger behind my back so that i can push my upper body towards my leg go ahead in a bicycle motion as if you're moving or kicking your legs and then we're gonna do a twisting motion bringing the elbow your left elbow to the right knee and your right elbow to the left knee so the next exercise is very popular is the sit-up exercise now um, to make this easier if you're a first timer and you've never done sit-ups before is definitely have something heavy that you can push your feet um, towards so that you're not moving but um, I've been doing this in a while so I have more core control so I can do this without putting anything um, to kind of like help my feet not move so again um, you can have something behind your back so that way it's more core focus and i'm not putting too much weight i'm pulling my body upwards now we're just doing those three sets of 20 you definitely will feel this so then i'm gonna move to a regular crunch now doing the regular crunch is definitely the topping on the cake because it definitely you can definitely feel the pressure you can definitely feel the soreness the midsection so again i'm doing three sets of 20 doing the crunch and again i am feeling it it is not easy it looks easy but it is very effective and it is one of those exercises if you do daily you definitely will see changes and you will definitely see a lot of improvements when it comes to the midsection area now you can also add the side crunch to it and the side crunch is basically the same thing as a regular crunch but you just kind of like reaching also remember to keep your head upward so my head is lifted up from the floor while i am reaching towards my toes and this definitely helps you know slam down the sides if you have love handles and all that good stuff now next we're gonna start with the raw, raw. <laughs> so next we're gonna go ahead with the rushing twist these two um these um exercise movements are again core focus and these are very effective also lifting your legs up makes it a little bit more challenging so if you want to challenge yourself lift your legs up from the floor while your torso back a little bit holding weights on your hand something like a dumbbell maybe eight pounds ten pounds depending on how far you can go helps you know putting pressure to your torso and just challenge yourself so then you're gonna go ahead and slowly start twisting your torso from right to left remember to keep your core tight and breathe through and this exercise again three sets of 20 you can start the twist three sets of 10 if you're just a beginner but again these are very effective core workouts and as you can see i'm also doing the sit up with the dumbbell just again to challenge myself to keep the momentum going and just um focus more on core so next let's move on with the legs glutes and quads so starting with a kettlebell swing we're gonna go ahead and 
So you're gonna go ahead and take a kettlebell and stand on two weight platforms. That way you have a little bit, a little bit of height. And what we're gonna do is start swinging the bell up. And as it comes down, you're pushing your butt as if you're hitting a door, you're closing a door. So again, swing up and push back with your butt. This focus more on your glutes and quads. As you guys can see, um, it's a lot more focused there. And again, standing on a platform helps with those muscle connection so again i am doing three sets of 20 swinging up and pushing back with my butt this is more of a leg workout there's not much effort with your hands again keep your hands straight as you pulling or swinging up i am not doing much movement with my hand besides we're gonna go ahead and do a side lunge um, with the kettlebell um, focusing more on the legs and glutes again this is more of the side glutes and legs and quads focus as you guys can see I have one of my legs on a platform that way it's more focus muscle focus connection focus and I am swinging not swinging but I'm bringing the kettlebell towards the right side of my legs and again it's more like a crisscross but i am pushing more of my weights towards the leg that is on top of the platform again you will feel these these are very effective workout that i do regularly whenever i'm at the gym and it doesn't it doesn't ever let me down these are really effective try these on your next workout and let me know you will feel the burn again i am feeling it right now this is how effective this is So now we're gonna do some wide leg and squats. Um, again, just regular squat with these, just kind of finish the dumbbell workout. Again, I'm just coming not too low. I'm just bringing it, uh, I'm just bringing the dumbbell um, lower to the ground. And again, it's really good and it's a good idea to keep in mind whenever you're doing any workout, don't look too much you're at yourself in the mirror look towards the floor that way your torso your back is aligned so i find that very effective so next workout is a single leg bridge so this right here is a glute focus get ready for that one so you're gonna start with your shoulder resting on a bench to support your upper body so you're gonna drop your hips until you are nearly sitting down so nearly hitting the floor and then you're gonna raise your body back up as high as you can and fully contract your butt at the top of the motion so again you can use any type of weight to keep your the legs that's on a 90 angle from not moving so kind of like a pressure to keep it in place to finish it up we're gonna go to the leg extension machine and again this is a really good finished <laughs> leg workout just to kind of burn everything off and it's not as much energy because we're sitting down so i always leave the leg extension machine for the last bit just to kind of like reach there so i'm doing 150 no 160 pounds and again three sets of 20 is my usual and leg burning glutes quads focus exercises that i've been trying over the time that i've been working out and again i've been seeing a lot of improvements and so let me know down in the comment section below if you guys did enjoy this anything else that you guys would like to see me do focus on i can definitely do that um let me know down in the comment section below thank you guys for watching bye